Welcome back. Problem 1-42. This problem is taken from chapter number 1 that is stress and the book name is Mechanics of Material by R.C. Hibbler. So statement is determine the average shear stress developed in pin A of the trust. A horizontal force of P 40 kN is applied to joint C. Each pin has a diameter of 25 mm and is subjected to double shear. So you can see this is the trust. At point C we have a load of P and at point A we have a pin support and at point B we have a roller support. At A we have pin support. So you can see this is the side view and there is a pin which is double shear. So we have to find the average shear stress developed in the pin. So let's start with the solution. So first step is that if you remove this support at point B so you will be having a reaction force which is represented as by and if you remove this pin support at point a so you will be having a vertical force in downward direction which is a y and there will be a horizontal force in negative x direction which is a x so we'll find this a y a x and b y by using internal loading so i will write internal loading we will apply equation of equilibrium in order to find these stresses or forces so first equation of equilibrium is that sum of all moments about point a is equal to zero and taking the counterclockwise moment as positive so about point a these two these two forces a y and a x are not producing moment because they are passing through it so first moment that is produced by this b y into perpendicular distance is 2 about point a will be in counterclockwise direction so, so it will be positive the second moment about point a due is due to this p load and perpendicular distance is 1.5 and it is producing clockwise so it will be negative and the sum of these two moments will be equal to 0 about point a so i will write b y into 2 minus P into 1.5 is equal to 0. So 2BY minus P is given as 40. So 40 into 1.5 is equal to 0. So we will get 2BY will be equal to 40 into 1.5. And when you calculate it, you will get By will be equal to 30 kilo Newton. Now you have this By. So we will move and we will find AX and AY. So for finding AX, we will apply this equation of equilibrium that sum of all forces along horizontal must be equal to zero and force in this direction is taken as positive. So you can see this force which is AX is negative plus this PY which is in this positive direction is uh, P. So their sum must be equal to zero. So minus AX plus P is equal to zero. So from here AX will be equal to P. And we know that the value of P is 40 kilo Newton. So AX is equal to 40 kilo Newton. Now you have this AX as well. And we will find AY by using in third equation of equilibrium. That is sum of all forces along Y direction must be equal to zero and upward force is taken as positive. So we have two forces. One is this one minus AY and plus by their sum must be equal to zero so i will write minus a y plus b y is equal to zero so a y is equal to b y and b y is equal to 30 kilo newton now you can see we have all these three reaction forces so you can see that uh, at point a so if we find the reaction forces of these two so this will be equal to a force and this a force uh, will be equal to or we can also write f a f a so this f a by using Pythagoras theorem 
नेट फोर्स एट ए नेट फोर्स एट ए विल बी इक्वल टू एफ ए एंड दैट विल बी इक्वल टू ए एक्स स्क्वेयर प्लस ए वाई स्क्वेयर अंडर द रूट सो जस्ट पुट द वैल्यू ए एक्स इज फोर्टी सो फोर्टी स्क्वेयर प्लस ए वाई इज थर्टी सो थर्टी स्क्वेयर सो फ्रॉम हेयर वेन यू कैलकुलेट इट यू विल गेट एफ ए विल बी इक्वल टू फिफ्टी किलो न्यूटन नाउ दिस फिफ्टी किलो न्यूटन एक्ट्स ऑन दिस पिन सपोर्ट एट पॉइंट ए सो यू कैन सी दैट वी हैव बीन गिवन दैट द पिन इज ईच पिन हैज़ अ डायमीटर ऑफ ट्वेंटी फाइव मिली मीटर एंड इज सब्जेक्टेड टू डबल शेयर इट मीन्स दैट इफ यू ड्रॉ द पिन लाइक दिस फिर सो द नेट फोर्स दैट इज एक्टिंग ऑन दिस पिन इज इन दिस डायरेक्शन और the direction of this will be in this direction why because these these two are both in negative direction so this force will be equal to fa so due to double shear there will be a shear force va in this direction as well as in this direction so va so by using equation of equilibrium that uh, this uh, shear force va will be equal to f divided by f a divided by 2 due to symmetry so 50 divided by 2 is equal to 25 kilo newton why because we have double shear okay now you have this shear force so we will move and we will find the average sharing shear stress so i will write average shear stress which is equal to tau and that is equal to shear force va divided by sharing area so what how we will find sharing area so diameter of pin is given so area sharing area will be this one and this diameter is given 25 mm which in meter is 0.025 meter so area is of circular shape or circular pin is pi by 4 d square so put the value pi by 4 into 0.025 power 4 will give you 0.4909 into 10 to the power minus 3 square meter now you have v you have shear stress so you can just put over here that average sharing stress is equal to va divided by sharing area clear so va is 25 kilo newton so 25 into 10 to the power 3 newton divided by sharing area is 0.4909 into 10 to the power minus 3 and that will give you 50.9 into 10 to the power 6 pascal and when you convert it into mega pascal so it will be 50.9 mega pascal and this is the answer of our this question so the average shear stress de develop in pin at point a is 50.9 mega pascal and that was all about this problem 1-42 i hope you have enjoyed this video and you have learned from it those who are new to my channel then subscribe it and don't forget to press the bell icon so that you can get notification about my latest videos if you have any question you can ask me in comment section thank you for watching